Hunt with passion. Never stop casting. Chase the dream. Welcome to Season 4 of Muskie Mastery Outdoors. Brought to you by Joe Booker Outdoors, number one in big game fish products. And by Recon Boats. Made by craftsmen, built for fishermen. It's a decent fish, actually. It's not bad. Okay. All right. Wow, she is fighting up a storm, huh? Not a bad fish. Not a bad fish at all. I think she's hooked decent. I think she's hooked okay. Let's see if I can't. Get the net on her. Right in the bag, baby. Touchdown. Touchdown, baby. Touchdown. All right. All right, guys. There she comes. A double eight Goldie Brute, man. Head shakes and everything. We got the light change. We changed color and we scored. Beautiful muskie right there, guys. We'll get her back and fill you in on all the details. Awesome fish. Another nice one. Wolf pack muskies. Wow. I don't know how well she's hooked. I don't know how well she's hooked. I don't think she's hooked that well. Oh boy. If we can't get the nut on her, that was the very next cast, guys. Oh, yeah, she's not hooked good. We got her. Oh my gosh. Wolfpack Muskie, second cast. The very next cast, guys. Unbelievable. Wow. Oh my god! Wolf pack muskies! Holy cow! Another one on the very next cast. Wow, beautiful fish right there, guys. We're gonna get her back. Goldilocks, double 800 booger tail is heating up, baby. Wow, back to back cast muskies. Woo! Awesome fish. Let's get her back and I'll fill you in on the details in just a second. Well guys, welcome back to another musky segment. I don't know what to tell you on this one, guys. I mean, <laughs> it was the very next cast. I mean, literally, 
I just released one and I literally cast all double A Booker Tail Tinsel Goldie. I mean, and another one smashed it. And you're and you're watching this right now unfold as I do the uh, the info part of this show, the, the the teaching moment. And this is really important to see what's going on right now. We had a window. A couple things, couple things happening here. Okay, to key in on. First of all, we had an afternoon major period. Okay that was about 4, 4.20 or so, okay? And I got on a, a really good spot right on that major period and uh, scored on the first fish and, and now obviously a second fish. So that's that's learning, you know, moment number one. If you're not into these moon phases yet, you have got to get in on the moon phases. Here's another perfect case in point, double up. A double up, baby, on the moon. Okay, number two, and this is now changing before your eyes, the light, okay? Uh, changed colors of my lure. Went from high skies earlier where uh, black and nickel was the hot ticket to wasn't raising any muskies on black and nickel and then we got overcast conditions. So I said, okay, let's go to one of my top producing overcast lures, Goldie. Goldie is, is just unbelievable, but especially when it's dark out, Goldie seems to really have something special going on. But but here's the, the third the third thing in this in this video that's really, really cool, guys. And this is probably the most important thing. Always go back to the spot you just caught a muskie. Always go back to the spot you just caught a muskie. Never catch one and then just leave. Because you're likely leaving behind two three, four, even five plus muskies on one spot. And uh, this might sound crazy to you if you haven't seen anything like this before, but the longer you stay in this sport and keep at it, you will find, if you haven't already, that you can find as many as five, even, uh, I think I've raised an, it, it, nine different muskies off one spot once in, in an afternoon. Uh, so here's another here's another uh, a showing of that. It's, it's a wolf pack muskie thing. We've got two or more, there's probably five plus muskies up on this spot right now. And I just caught the second one. I'm gonna go right back and I'm gonna keep throwing Goldie because they keep eating it. Uh, and I'm gonna see if there's a third one on this spot. But that's the thing. It's the moon, the light change, picking a good spot on the moon phase. But then importantly, as you're fishing around these spots, you can't get intimidated by this boat traffic. I got boats and waves just blasting. I got skiers on chairs doing tricks. Like literally, I saw a skier on a chair just go by. Um, people are doing tricks and all this kind of stuff out here, but should it deter you from going out and musky fishing? Absolutely not. Get out there and make it happen. And uh, well guys, I gotta get back at it because this is just getting this is getting out of control. I'm having I'm having way, way shouldn't say I'm having too much fun. I'm having just the right amount of fun because this is awesome. When it happens like this in musky fishing, you just gotta sit back and say thank you because it's not always like this. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this segment and as always, thanks for watching. You're watching season four of Musky Mastery Outdoors. Be sure to tune in next week for more exciting and educational musky and multi-species action.